Novak Djokovic and Roger Federer are both preparing for the Miami Open. The tournament gets underway on Wednesday at the Hard Rock Stadium. The Serbian went through a series of stretches and also played football with kids. The Swiss star was spotted catching up with the former U.S. Player James Blake by Harry Slavin from Isle Online published, 9.42 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 19th of March 2019, updated, 10.14 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 19th of March 2019 Novak Djokovic and Roger Federer were both being put through their paces on Monday evening ahead of the start of the Miami Open. Both are in the draw for the tournament, which is being held at the Hard Rock Stadium for the first time. The Serb and Swiss stars took different approaches as they trained ahead of the tournament start on Wednesday, with Djokovic opting for more unconventional measures. Novak Djokovic goes to some stretches as he prepares for a practice session in Miami. The Serbian is in the main draw for the tournament which at the Hard Rock Stadium the 31-year-old had a kickabout with local kids before entering the court to hit a few balls the reigning U.S. Open. Champion posed for photographs with fans and signed autographs Djokovic changed his shirt on the side of the court before continuing with his session The 31-year-old could be seen playing football with children before getting onto the court and also went through a rig iris stretching session too to get himself prepared. Meanwhile, Federer caught up with former U.S. star James Blake outside the courts before hitting some balls on the main court. The pair are on opposite sides of a political feud in the world of tennis at the moment, with the Serb leading a movement to oust ATP Supremo Chris Mode. Roger Federer was also at Miami Gardens to hit a few balls ahead of the tournament Federer shakes greets the former US tennis star James Blake ahead of his practice speaking recently, Federer revealed he had been snubbed by his rival after asking him to meet before leading a meeting that saw a decision taken not to renew Kermode's contract, I tried to meet Novak on the deadline before the meeting, said Federer. Unfortunately he had no time. That's hard to understand for me, he certainly had a lot to do with the whole story. I asked him if he had time to meet me, it was so busy. He suggested that we see each other the day after, but everything was already decided, advertisement.